Hey everyone, welcome to Shadow Nerds this week. I'm super excited for this one. This is an unboxing video of World's Finest. Uh, if you don't know what that is, check it out on World's Finest uh, Collectibles.com, I believe it is. So we're doing an unboxing video. Um, what it is, it's a subscription box, just like Legion of Collectors, the, the, uh, the Loot Crate, things like that. This is... This is this week's box. This is the second one I've actually gotten. The first one was a Batman box, which was super awesome. Uh, it was great. They were actually sold out, which which means everybody wanted them, so that's a good thing. Uh, this one, the deal with World's Finest boxes are they get shipped to you every. Let's see, you get it four times a year, so every three every three months you get one one for one box for every season. This is for the winter box. This that's what this is. It's, uh, let's see, it's $48.99 for the box. You pay that four times a year for the boxes uh, right before they ship. So you don't have to pay it all at once or anything. There is a version where you can pay it all at once and you get all four boxes at one time uh, immediately, which is, I don't know, I don't like getting them all at once because I like looking forward to something every couple months. So yeah, it's $48.99 every three months. That's awesome, and again, it's over $100 worth of stuff. That's huge to me. So let's get into it. This is the box. I, ooh, I heard something kind of crazy inside, almost fragile. Um, I'm kind of pissed at what they did on shipping. If you look at it, it's uh, the plastic was ripped. And the box itself was damn. Oh yeah, look, look at that. Look, look at that. What kind of bullshit is that? Now I get it. They probably don't give a shit because it's not theirs. Um, shipping, you know, you, you're always. It's the best of luck on shipping, basically. So, really pisses me off though. And they wrote on my box, which I think they do on everyone, uh, but it's still annoying because these are really cool boxes. So, let's get into it. This is obviously Wonder Woman. Yay! All right. It's like Christmas, honestly, because you get to wrap some pla rip some plastic off this thing. Sorry if the camera shakes. Uh, things are going to be getting better every every video. Uh, just bear with me. So it's heavy. This thing is heavy. It's got to weigh, I'd say five pounds. Five pounds roughly. Look at that. Cool box. Rustic look, bordering around the edges. The logo. The stars on the side, plain back, but you know, even as a display box, I mean, this is awesome. So, and it's gonna go next to my other one, so it's a, like I said, it's a cool display piece. All right, let's get inside this thing. Let's see. All right. I'm really excited. I okay. Let me before I open this. I love Wonder Woman. Uh, for me, it's Superman, Batman, and Wonder Woman. The Trinity. I love them. Uh, Wonder Woman is definitely probably my favorite female superhero, uh, other than, you know, Supergirl or something, but yeah, I, I love me some Wonder Woman, as you can tell behind me, I don't know if you can see, but yeah, there's a few Wonder Woman posters in here. Alright, ready? Sweet! This is awesome. Oh, and the inside of the box, before I show you what's actually inside... is a display of its own. Wonder Woman, 75 years. So it's the 75th anniversary of Wonder Woman. I'm a little surprised that they didn't do this box earlier in the year because of the movie, obviously, which was a huge success. Um, but, you know, who knows? All right, here we go. Um, let's go smallest to biggest first, in my opinion, anyway. Let's go. <laughs> okay. I'm sold. These are awesome. Wonder Woman ice cube trays of her invisible jet. You can't see them because they're invisible, get it? No, I'm just kidding. Um, this is freaking cool. This is really cool. I'm super excited about this. Um, my girl's going to love these things because anything like this, she's into. So that is awesome. See there? Pretty freaking cool. You get four of them. All right, let's see what else we got. That's a win already. Um, <laughs> all right. If I was a tennis player, I would totally rock these. Headband and wristbands. 
the star, the logo, awesome. These are really cool. Um, I don't really know who wears sweatbands anymore, but if you did, this would be awesome. Uh, but regardless, this is still a cool collectible item uh, for display as well. Because, because I mean, look at it. It's really colorful too, which is great. All right. Let's see. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Comes in its own little case. Uh, there's oh yeah, it's a logo. It's the logo on there. They're pins. So we got uh, two buttons. Yeah, they're all pins. Two two pin buttons. A tiara. Her. Pretty good, right? That's pretty cool. The little pins on the back. Okay. Old school Wonder Woman. Around the first appearance, I believe. In the classic logo. Awesome. That's cool. I like pins. I like buttons. Um, put them on backpacks. Uh, any sort of bag, really. That's that's really cool. So, again, and you get this little case with it, which is awesome. And I, I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's got a Wonder Woman logo on it. See there? The reflection a little bit. That's cool. So, yeah, awesome. All right, let's see what we got next. Let's go ahead. Uh, let's go ahead and do the shirt. We got a shirt, which is awesome. Who doesn't love shirts? Clearly I do. All right. You do get to tell them your size before you order. That way you don't get an extra large if you wear a large because that would suck. So you do get to, to tell them that. Here we go. Awesome. Let me see that. Oh, Alex Ross. Definitely, definitely looks like some Alex Ross. If you don't know who that is, um, you live under a rock as far as if you're a comic book fan. But, um... Huge illustrator, uh, did the, uh, let's see, the, um, the, uh, the Kingdom, uh, what was it called, uh, the, the Kingdom series, uh, Justice as well, things like that, um, great art, her reflecting bullets off her bracelets, which is awesome, Kingdom Come, Jesus, Kingdom Come, wow, I follow Alex Ross on Twitter, he does art like this all the time, so it's nice to see it on a shirt. Because uh, it's not easy to buy. So, nothing on the back. But uh, yeah, great. I'm super excited about that. The missus is going to love this because it'll definitely be something that she'll wear. Cool little case. There is something inside of the case, so don't think you're getting gypped. That's probably what I heard earlier that I thought was fragile. Um, so, that's good. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> Here we go. Hold on. Hold on. They're postcards. They're all little postcards. I don't know who does postcards anymore, but if you do, you got some Wonder Woman ones. Oh, wait a minute. Nope, this way. Okay, here we go. Nope, yeah, I was right. Awesome. And I believe they all have the same logo on them. Let's see. The same uh, cover. No, there are four different covers. All right, so there's one. Dose. I, I want to say that's George Perez. The George Perez version. Which is awesome. This is even more old school. Really cool there, Sensation Comics. Stop on the train. We got one more. Oh, here we go. Check that out. Check that out. That's awesome. All right. Um, oh, no, there's one more. There is one more. Can you see that? That's really cool. These postcards are awesome. Great, great buy. Even if you don't use them, they're just cool because who does it? Like, who... One woman postcards. How many people can say they have those? So that's pretty cool. One last one. Her uh, having a tango with a pair of tweezers. Uh, that reminds me of uh, half of my life. You know, getting a splinter out or something. So, awesome. That's great. Postcards. Cool. Let's see what we got next. Hold on. Let me put these away. We're not damaging anything. 
the last thing I want to do, especially when they came in this cool case. I mean, the case alone, you can put anything in the case. Um, and that's total, that's worth it right there. So, all right, ready? Let's see what we got next. If this is what I think it is, I love these. I, I have a thing for these. Yes, it is. I love these. Oh, no, this is the jingle. And that really worries me. Oh, man. You hear that? This really fucking sucks. Damn it. Okay, well, it's supposed to be a Lasso of Truth mug. Um, it's hard to have a mug without a fucking handle. Damn it. Good job, bubble wrap. You fucked. Man, that really upsets me. Um, besides that, besides the fact that it's broken, if it wasn't broken, it would be awesome. It's a cool mug, uh, the Lasso of Truth mug. Again, there's that. The whole thing is supposed to be like the, you know, the lasso wrapped around a million times. The logo protrudes a little bit. See the profile there? Awesome. <sighs> Severely disappointed by that one. Thanks, shipping. All right, let's see what else we got. This is cool. What is it? I know it's a shield, obviously. There's her on the back, 75 years, blah, blah, blah. All right. I don't want to break the box too bad. Let's see what we got. Obviously her shield on a stand and the sword. It's plastic, but that's okay. So the shield does come off. It's got little straps on the back, which is really cool. It goes back in the stand. Oh, this thing's heavy. It's a sword. It's a letter opener. That's cool. Because who doesn't get mail? Who doesn't get bills? So that's cool. A little letter opener. And not many people have letter openers. So a Wonder Woman one? That's even better. Okay. Let's put that back. That is cool. And it comes on a little stand. So it looks like it's, you know, it's meant to display the eagle on the shield there. That's awesome. I'm, I'm totally okay with that. All right. One last thing. Let's see what we got here. Boom! That is cool. I love statues. Statues is my thing. Love, love, love me some statues, especially of the superheroes. Um, exclusive, World's Finest, a collection. One Roman vinyl figure. I don't know if I want to take it out, but here I'll show it to you guys. You can see it. It's her in a case. You know what? Fuck it, I'll take it out. Here we go. Let's do that. Sweet! Even better, it comes with a stand. Wow, that is awesome. It's a long ass sword. I love, love, love this and the stand for it to go on, which is awesome. I love me some statues and stands, like severely. And this is good detail too. This isn't like cheap crap. This is this is a good little, good little Wonder Woman statue, dude. I'd probably say I don't know if you can tell size wise. But I'd probably say it's uh, roughly six inches tall, which is 
you know, a good statue. So six inches tall, roughly. And it comes a little uh, issue uh, in the back. Little image in the back. I believe that's Frank Cho from the Rebirth, uh, the Rebirth run right now. From one of the first four issues, I forget, but I believe that was a Frank Cho variant, which is awesome. Um, so yeah, that is super cool. That's it. That's that's what's in the box. Um, again, the inside. Let's show you that real quick. Yep, yep, yep. All right, just to do a quick recap. Let's see. We got the statue and the stand, which is very important. We got the shirt. Alex Ross, I believe. <sighs> My broken mug, which really fucking sucks. We got <laughs> the sweatbands for you tennis players out there who want to look like Wonder Woman, which is okay. That's cool. I, I'm not going to lie. I'm totally hype about these because um, I do use ice quite a bit because um, I drink a lot of soda, unfortunately. But, um, yeah, the, these, these invisible jet ice cube trays, awesome. Totally worth it. The letter opener and stand. Awesome. That is really cool. I'm, gonna, I'm probably going to use it because I get a ton of mail, unfortunately. Um, oh! The pens. Again, worth it. Totally worth it. And you get a little case with padding. I mean, come on. You can use these things for anything. The postcards. This is the metal case that they come in, by the way. And on the back, it has an image of all the postcards that come on it. Come in it, so. Really, really cool on that one. Uh, let's see. Yeah, that was it. Right? Yeah, that's it. Um, thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. Tell me what you thought about everything in the comments below. Uh, let me know what you think of the World's Finest Collection if you go to the site and check it out. What you think. Is it worth it to me? Totally worth it. Totally over $100 worth of stuff. Um, I couldn't be happier. Um, let me know what you think in the comments below the video, what you liked. Um, if you like the Wonder Woman stuff, I love it. I thought it was awesome. Please like, please subscribe, and in general, just thank you for watching. Thanks for giving me your time each and every week. I promise these videos will be getting better and better. Um, next week, I already have an idea as to what I'm going to do. It's not going to be an unboxing video. But it's totally worth checking out, and I can't wait for you guys to see it next week. Again, please like, subscribe, um, and we'll see you next week. Shadow Nerds, we are out.